Hello. In this video, you will learn how to overload operators in Python. If I would ask you to add an item to this to-do list on paper, you would know what to do. Although the to-do list is not the same thing as one item on the list, you would still know what I mean. But if we would create a to-do list class, I cannot add an item to this class because I need to add the item to the list that is in the class. One option is to make a method called addToDo that adds the to-do item to the list. But there's an alternative. It is called operator overloading and it allows us to add, subtract and multiply things of different types, like a to-do list and a to-do item. Let's go. I create class to-do list that has a list of to-dos. I overload Dunder string to present the items. I create an instance of the class and print it. I execute the code. Now I would like to add an item to the to-do list class like this. When I execute this, I get an error. Python tells us it cannot add a string to an object of type to-do list. But we can use operator overloading to allow this. To overload the add operator, I implement dunder add. Dunder add returns a new instance of the to-do list that takes the old to-dos and appends the new item. I execute the code. We get a new to-do list object and you can see the item is added. You can overload operators like add, subtract, divide and multiply. I hope this helps you.